Right, so today's plan really is to pick a panel and crack on with some bodywork. Um, this is the, I'm just going to start with this rear floor. Uh, it's the one that scares me the least to be honest. Uh, it's, it's got a few, few big, few big things in it. Uh, we use the cooler. Uh, we've got a dead cooling machine. Uh, everything's a bit, bit of a mess, so we're going to sand it all back, see where we're at, and then uh, start from there, really. So, yeah, I'll stick it on the time lapse uh, and get sanding because that's the bonus. Right, before I start uh, pulling that dent in the interest of time, what I'm going to do, make up a wee bit of filler. Uh, there's a few few wee bits that need uh, need filled on that quarter that don't need pulled. So I'll get them filled first uh, and as that's dry and then I'll, I'll haul out the dent puller and uh, try and multitask. So, right. so for this bit, prepped up the area, got a really big dent in here. So we've got a dent pulling machine at work. I'm gonna pop that on there and see if we can get most of that out before I need to get in and start filling it. So yeah, the slide hammer ended up being useless, so decided to get the the big big cooler out. So here I am just uh, welding on the rings onto the side of the the quarter panel just to to get it ready for the the bar going through to pull. Um, nothing too exciting. Now, grab the actual pulling machine, put the bar through. Um, and as you can see, uh, it pulls pretty, pretty easy to be honest. This is pretty heavy duty, a heavy duty machine. Pulled it out enough to, to get it to a place where um, I'm happy to fill it rather than just be layering on loads and loads of fillers. Yeah, so so far, um, done a lot. A lot of grinding and sanding on this this passenger side. Uh, that's fill number three, actually, on those on those dents. Um, I'll still need to do another, maybe one or two, just to get them properly smoothed out. But everything's coming up pretty nice. Yeah, grind and sanded all the all the tops of the as well. Um, also done all the window shuts just because that's so awkward and, and time consuming. There was a lot of filler in there actually already, but we've we've started tackling that. Um, also started started on the roof as well. Wasn't too bad, to be fair. There's a couple of deep scratches in there that I'll need to feather out before we, we do anything with paint. Uh, I've not done this side with the gutter in, um, but this side I've done, done a fair bit more. Um, yeah, it's getting there. I mean, time now. As you can see from the mess of me, uh, I've been at this for a while. Uh, came in about 11 o'clock this morning, and that's it. Coming up for six, six at night. So yeah, it's been a been a good day. Don't actually intend to stop anytime soon. So I'll uh, I'll keep going and keep filming. When you stick some other pieces on, wings, bonnet, stuff like that, it actually looks alright, to be fair. Um, yeah, so, can't complain. Might try on the other wheels as well, at some point. But yeah, looks looks sweet, even sitting with all different colours, bit of a mix mash. Filler, not done, but yeah, that back quarter's coming together pretty well, and obviously, once that's done, it's new wings, bonnet's pretty much done. So there's not an awful lot left of the car, to be fair. So if I can get these quarters done pretty quick, uh, tidy up, tidy up some other bits and pieces, I don't think it's gonna take me as long as I think. 